Hello, everybody, and welcome back. Hello, people of Earth. I was kind of doing that voice, wasn't I? <laughs> Why are you gonna call me out like that? I'm, I'm doing it too. Alex got me so many gifts, you guys. He got me donut. He got me cupcake. He got me ice cream. He got me brownie. He made me dinner. I'm on cloud nine over here. Honey, please, please. Wait until there's more viewers here. So they, so they can all hear. What a great husband I have. <laughs> <laughs> no, what's really happening is that he's spending so much time treating me right. He's, he has no time for you losers anymore. <laughs> Okay, welcome to chapter 13 of Broken World. Jeez. Yeah, cheery name. Walled in on all sides. Linger's biggest and most infamous entertainment center. Wall market. When you are on your own play on your own file. Do you play like up to the last battle that I've done? 
Uh, I complete the last battle we've completed. Nice. Like, my save file right now is right after the big ghost. Ghosting. We didn't re watch that cutscene. Oh, do it right now. We, we need to go watch that cutscene that, like. That it fucked up so bad that we saw, like, one frame of, like, cat mm -hmm. person. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, man. You wrote the letter Y, and Google's like, oh, you want Yuna Final Fantasy X? <laughs> like, almost. Yeah, close enough. I have <clears throat> My fingers. He's like so sleepy. He can't even smell my fingers. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna have to manually wash my fingers like a peasant. <laughs> um, red. Almost there. Oh, should I show them what I what I clicked to? I I, I clicked. I I just clicked randomly into the middle. Got this. Yep, that's I know that's, that's what you there. usually go to when yep. you upload this video, but that's not what we need today. I okay, I now I have to show it. I was looking, you know, all cutscenes, right? <laughs> Look at the third one down. Uh -huh. That's not in that's there. Not in there. <laughs> sure isn't. That's not. That doesn't happen. I'm pretty sure. I uh, I think that's a bit of a bait. Uh, okay, so this is the ghosts. Yep. I had it coming. Jeez. Tifa. Oh, um. Lump. Turn yourself off. Okay. There we go. So we saw all this. Okay, here here's where we need to watch from. I mean, they're killing oh all of Avalanche. <laughs> oh no! It's so sad! Okay, so it really isn't it. Just, there's no explanation for it. There's no reason for that to be happening. Yeah, some sort of suspension wire. Oh. Yeah, how would you justify that to yourself if you were part of that? Like, drop, dropping a nuke. Yeah, really. I mean, that happened. Yep. I'm Once sure upon those, a time. I'm sure those people have a very difficult rest of their life. <laughs> You know, and then she's like, Bye, yeah, she, I'm not processing. She just walks away. She does not That's want so to talk. Funny. I think we've all experienced, <laughs> hopefully, not this. Thank you, Wolf. Thank you, Wexel. Um, I think we've all experienced the feeling of something bad that's going to happen. So let's say it's your family going through a difficult financial time. Like maybe 
someone's losing their job and, and it's not really anyone's fault it just what is what it is maybe it's your car breaks down and you know it's going to be really expensive to repair i think we've all had times where it's like something so bad is about to happen that we're so desperate for it not to happen and yet there's not really anything we can do and that's where tifa it was you know tifa was like maybe the plate won't fall like mm -hmm. like maybe there's some way to avoid it there wasn't there was not really a way to stop the, the force they were up against was too powerful but it feels so crushing once it does happen we fought two two of the of the turks to a standstill sorry i i do have to wash my oh, okay. hands yeah I have, I haven't done that and they still all they had to do was hit a button <clears throat> There's no way we were gonna. If we prevented him from doing it right then, they were just gonna do it. The, like the next group they sent was gonna do it, and the next, and the next, and the next. All right. You want the gamer chair? Sure, I'll take the gamer chair. Sorry for big noise in the mic. <laughs> Bop the table accidentally. They'll be okay. Well, the seat's nice and warm because you're in it. <laughs> you want to get me a little slice of the cake? My mom? Sure. My mom dropped me off a cake too. It's, it's a uh, pumpkin cake, I think. All I know is, it, know is it's sweet and delicious. Heck yeah, Wolf. Hey! Channel points do that. Anybody out there? Barret! I think I hear him up ahead. Let's go get a Barret, shall we? Hey! Here it goes. Can anybody and hear push. me? <sighs> she could probably push most of that because she's our bruiser. At least Barrett does know that his daughter is okay. That has been Marlene. established. Wait, I thought he knows. Marlene. No, Barrett, it's okay. She's okay. Marlene. I guess he didn't see the video. Marlene. Nice, Wolf. Biggs! Witch! Jesse! Oh, Barrett. Those people God are less okay. It. Hi, Megan! Oh, your fists aren't really meant to strike against concrete. You're you're gonna break your you're gonna break your knuckles, and then you're gonna be of no use to anyone. No, happy birthday to you, Megan. In in 14 days. I'm gonna take a break from watching him destroy his fist. It was us. We did this. Okay, well, that didn't work out quite like I had hoped. No. You can't think like that. Whatever came before it was sin with the Thank you, Vex. Thank you, Vex. I want to use my almond milk. Very important. Yeah. The size of his fist, geez. <laughs> Hold on to this. This anger, okay? Barrett. Marlene's fine. Huh? Aerith found her. Aerith? Is that the girl they took? Yeah. 
That's her. Hmm. He's got a very the hell's going on? dirty. I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. <sighs> and she did. You sure? Hey, where are you going? Thanks, nice Mega Mania. Congratulations. Good work, I'm sure. I don't think this isn't my autometer. <coughs> Computer science. It's so scientific. Oh, yeah. Megan, you should um, make mods for your favorite games. How could this happen? Science. I didn't really think that. I didn't really think that. There's nowhere for them to go. When is help going to arrive? Is this for real? You think he's okay? Shinra needs our support now. Can't give up hope. This wasn't an accident, was it? How would I know? How would I know? Stop it with that talk. That is <laughs> to think about. Nice camera. I love how everyone had something to say. I wreck those signs. <laughs> He's doing the thing that I do. I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. <laughs> where, is. where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Give me something to hang on to. Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. <laughs> Aaron knows what an emotional guy he is. He's not apologetic about it. Know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them at least. They come up in planetology books. Happy birthday. Sorry, it's not 1k. I'll make up for the rest next few days. Oh, that is more than enough. Thank you so much for the 500 bits, Colbridge. Let's give the dogs some treats. I missed that. What is an ancient? Uh, I was not paying attention at all. Oh, apparently Sephiroth knows. This planet is my birthright. Lore? Did they say they could, like, talk to the spirit of the planet or something? Oh, man! Look at those clothes. You have failed again, I see. They've never heard that sound out of Cloud's mouth. Suffering, you will grow strong. Oh, isn't that what you want? <laughs> He's got places to be. Hmm? It's nothing. So that wasn't a flashback, was it? Or is no. it left unclear? No, I don't. Head think... bear, it's like bite. <clears throat> no, those aren't flashbacks. I don't know if you want any. I will. I know it's not really your thing. Can you see Duke in the camera? Can you make it big? Oh. Hmm. Um. <laughs> hmm. I think I can. Yep, yeah, I can see him. I can see him. This dog treat, it's from Cobra. Yeah. He's great. Everybody's getting the birthday treats today. Mm-hmm. 
for all we know, this could be his birthday too. Oh. Bible boy, wild floppy zoom thing, bimbo pumpkin, you are amazing, and I hope you have an amazing day. <laughs> you picked emotes that would read really well in Justin's voice. Thank you so much, Eleven. Hey, girl. Eleven. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I'm gonna try and get with as little head movement as possible. This almond milk is soothing my throat. And spin the wheel as well. Well, we're in a good spot to spin the wheel. Do I need to manually save or anything, or would this menu be okay? I think I should mute it. Uh, yeah, you could probably just mute it. Okay, install tab. Wait for it to come all the Alex, way up. Alex um, and I got unlucky. He might have told you yesterday. Um, we both came down with a cold <laughs> this weekend. Um, and so my, my symptoms are like sore throat, headache, you just kind of achy and like getting chills. Um, and then what were your symptoms more like? I mean, yeah, I had a sore throat, headache. Yeah. You, got, you got, almost got like a fever at one point. Yeah, it was too warm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm still getting there. Paste those into WebMD. Do we have cancer? <laughs> Did what? you hear they're getting close to using um, the same technology they made to make the RNA vaccine uh, for COVID? Uh, sorry, for cancer vaccine? Fight cancer? I did not. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, let's do this. Let's do Wiki race. I love wiki race. All right, here we go. Oh, that's a that's a good quote. Um. Could you press accept result and then close oh, the yeah. wheel? No, I thought we would just enjoy the beautiful light. Uh, is this the one that you capture? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So. Colbridge, where would you like us to go? No, nah, that's two fingers, Wolf. You should go, go ahead and show us. Thank you. Very important. Always happy to be at your back and call. I... <laughs> You're gonna want to click English. Um... So I'll call over just figuring out what article he would like us to go to. I have a show recommendation some of you guys might have already um, seen. I, I hope it's not region locked. I hope anyone can watch it. It's called Owl House and it is very wholesome. It makes you smile. Um, it's technically rated TVY7, but it's definitely an all ages show. For all to enjoy. The animation's beautiful. <coughs> Bless Excuse you! Me. The voice acting is adorable. So if you need something wholesome in your life, it's a, it's a uh, it's a fantasy series. <laughs> do you guys have any special birthday traditions? We do. Um, whoever's birthday it is gets to choose uh, dinner. Whether it's going out to a restaurant or like what the what we cook or whatever, um, and I mean as far as traditions go, that's that's kind of it, right? I think it's just a dessert. That's very important. That's just part of dinner. True. Yeah, we don't really do. Big gifts on birthday. We usually do more like food, treats, cards. Special day. Yeah, I'll uh, probably go out and do something fun with Alex this weekend. Maybe I'll take a mini golfing. You know, they can do an escape room with me. 
Well, if Holbridge isn't here uh, soon enough, uh, what do you think? Should we just go back to the game, or should I, we just do a random random? I think I should get to pick. It's my birthday. Grace. That's why I'm asking you. You know what I want? What? Whenever I was asked to pick a mascot, you know, like in school, when they're like, all right, guys, you know, pick a team name pick a, or pick a mascot, this is what I pick. Oh, never mind. Colbert just got something for us. Oh, whoops. Also linked to the uh, mobile pitch. No, it's all good. No, it's okay, Colbert. No, stop. Uh, it's going to link you to the mobile page. Just copy paste the last part into uh, Wikipedia. There we go. But yeah, uh, it was jellyfish. I'm just gonna take a look at this beautiful jellyfish for a second. That is the jellyfish. I think we've all seen this particular image because it's free. <laughs> okay. What are you doing? I'm gonna find out how to pronounce it. Um, should we try this? No. We should abandon this and go back to the wiki race. <laughs> Twelve beautiful Welsh girls' names you'll wish were yours. <clears throat> Kevrai? Uh, oh, I, I, I don't know how to read phon phonetics. Kevrai Huel. Sure was a sister of law practiced in medieval Wales before its final conquest by England. Subsequently, the Welsh law's criminal codes were superseded by the Statute of Ludlan in 1284. Okay. Go ahead and open a what links here in a new tab by clicking the middle click on the far left under, oh, no, not like that, okay. <laughs> And then we'll go hit random article. Richard Cockwell. All right, Richard Cockwell. British born. He's already British. Falkland Islands politician. Oh, yeah, check that browser history, and you'll learn that I'm not stupid, and I use a different browser profile for stream. This links to British people. This links to British Empire. Hmm. Do you think the Falkland Islands would be closer, or do you think that British people would be closer? Hmm. I think British people is going to be closer, because then we can get to Wales from there, and then the Welsh history. Welsh. There's Welsh people. Um, I think there is al there's also another clickable Welsh. Uh, maybe that'll go to Wales. Oh, the Welsh. I think his parents hated him, says so Wexel. Oh yeah, because he's Dick Cockwell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great. You can just control F it if you want. Well, Unless this... you wanted to read this full article about the history of <laughs> British people. Wales. Well, look. Is it not clickable? Well, look, Wales? we might be able to get even closer. This is probably going to link here, right? This might get us uh, even closer. No, this is how Wales was annexed into England. I think this is, that's, like, too modern. Too recent. Thanks for that quote, Colbert. Birthday girl, check Discord. Oh no. You ready to have an anime girl sing to you? Yeah. Yes, I am. What's that? Not sure. Some YouTube recommendations. 
You get notifications for YouTube recommendations? Or not recommendation, but but something I follow, I guess. Anime boy. Oh right. All right. She doesn't finish the song. He doesn't finish the song. That bothers you, darling. Let me get this into my lap before I spill it everywhere again. Okay. Cake is important, okay? So you think I should go to the Wales people, not this? I think you should get to Wales the place. Okay. Let's try this. Wait, you opened a new tab. Oh, should I not do that? I guess that actually that'd probably be way easier to track how many clicks. This is why the other one was better. You gotta finish the song, yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of Welsh terms on here, right there. Did you control F the thing we're looking for? Yep, there it is. Got him. You were right. So all we had to do was go from this to British people to um to Wales to Wales, and then we got it. Only four clicks. Thank you, Dick Cockwell. How many pages link there? You should see. A lot. Show 500. Okay, 299 pages link there. But of course, some of those are just like, you know, Wikipedia talk pages and user pages and stuff. Darn <laughs> you, Cockwell. Six, was it? Yep. You pressed B. B is not the correct button to press there. He is not messing around. He's like, come on. Oh, you can uh, talk to your friend. Chocobo Sam. Every single <laughs> time, it's also tragic. Chocobos are so frightened they're refusing to move. Carts ain't running right now. He's okay. Sometimes the hurt is on the inside, so... I think that's a big bowl list. Wait. Over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their job's probably... <laughs> Their job! Focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Oh, sorry about that. No, I'm gonna get into trouble. What were we doing last time? So I was about to drop a plate of pizza in Sector Seven. Yeah, they dropped they, they dropped the, the, the slice of pizza speak, into Sector Seven and uh, completely destroyed it, and we were too late. Maldum, also, the, the uh, speak, Shinra has possession of uh. Aerith and Marlene, and we learned that Aerith is an ancient, and ancients uh, can talk directly to something. Yeah, we. Uh... I talked over there. I'm guessing it's the spirit of the earth. Did you find what you were looking for? Thanks to you, I did. Good. Now never let it go again. And then OBE, I think that makes him Sir Dick Cockwell. Right. I, I, I need to did not mean to show. disrespect Mr. Cockwell. Times like these, song and dance are truly essential. You would say that. I wanted to make sure I found what I was looking for. The first thing we need to do is find a place to pick refuge. 
Well, this is a fine mess. How bad is it here? Compared to Sector 7, we're doing fine. But that's hardly an accomplishment. We, we sometimes had, like, pizza parties. I think However, ice cream party is, is more common right, around here. What's going on. An ice cream social. <laughs> Pepperoni on it, lots of tomato sauce. Yeah, it seemed like there was a lot of tomato sauce. Yeah. Um, sometimes teachers would bring in um, donuts to kind of like, as a reward if the class had been extra good or uh, did really well on a, on a test collectively. Um, Pepsi, but that's just, I like the idea of there being like pizza. <laughs> but yeah, they would do pizza parties, ice cream socials. Um, some classes we did like a full like. Oh, and bring something. Uh, you know what else buffet. happened is um, spoilers. Uh, Jesse and Biggs and probably, or sorry, Jesse and Wedge and probably Biggs died. Died. Just, just are you dead. Run into Jesse Since we Bella. didn't yeah. witness Biggs too. Wedge die. Let me through, damn it. Let me through. My but Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. Need uh, assistance. Let's go home for the Alright, we'll sorry, 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 sorry. There's too much story going on. Stop that. Yeah, give us the story, Esper. Pepsi had the sixth largest navy in the world, says Goldberg. I don't know if it counts as the navy if they're not a country. Whoa, whoa, the reflection. The reflection, though. Oh, that's weird. Wow, boo! Where's the ray tracing? On short hiatus because you brought up Jesse. We're all scared. Oh, Chocobo love. You know how much I love Chocobos. I remember when we were at PAX and there was a Chocobo car. There were three Chocobo cars, and one of them was the special white Chocobo. We gotta go so. find the others. Huh? No. No, we don't. They're just, they're, they're very dead. Big Cloud. Gonna need your help with it too. I'm busy. Right. Yeah, my throat is still kind of killing me. Is there any chance you would make me sing? <laughs> Chelsea bought us a kettle. An electric kettle. It's a very nice kettle. Yeah, that's how we make it. Too. Hey guys. What does this mean for Midgar's future? Pretty bad. My ears are still ringing from it. This wasn't an accident, was it? Probably not. Not another bombing? Chessie's bomb guild doesn't work. You, the player, know from frame one the collateral damage wasn't her fault. I really don't like the whole arc surrounding her because it's built on a lie that we know from the beginning is a lie. Right, though, we're story time. This I agree with you, Esper. Right. So, where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side. Yeah, of town. I think they show their Come hand on, too man. much with uh, showing it shimmering as fast as you intentions. Are. Hey, what's up? Play really fall? <laughs> He's been here in the shop the whole time. <laughs> You've already seen those for sale, I think, right? You can't buy items, though. He doesn't have any. This was a weapon shop. It's too dangerous these days not to keep a weapon at your side. <laughs> uh, yeah. Dude, I, I got one. <laughs> Didn't you notice? Schools have safety drills, yeah. Is that cat just an Easter egg, says Wexel? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. No, uh, we did go back and see the cutscene, uh, in case... Oh, no, I think you were there for that, yeah. No, the, the cat the cat has to be important at some point. Wow, just taking an interest in everyone's sorrow. First it was all like shaking, then it was all like boom, crash, bam! I felt the shaking. But don't remember an explosion. There was this rumbling, and then all of a sudden, it was real sky. Maybe we can watch the sunrise 
I'm supposed to talk to them here. No, you're supposed to go to her house. Oh, well. Are you talking about, um, Aerith's house? Yeah. No, I was supposed to, I was supposed to, uh, check in there. Because, um, you know who told me to. Biggs did. Attention to the kid. Oh, this is a Spanish class and the teacher was so happy about how well the class was behaving. I'm guessing other classes are being rowdy. Then we were gonna have a party on Friday and to bring food and drinks in. Okay. That's the house. Marlene! Marlene! Now I gotta go here. So beautiful here. I know, the fact that this is a story is, is making me nervous. It's like, wait, so how does it all go wrong? Friday comes Where's Marty? Right is she here? Barrett. <sighs> Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Uh, Marlene, she's got short hair, she's cute as a button, with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing a she's pink dress today. Upstairs. She did make it here. Huh? Wow. No. <laughs> I said she's sleeping. Uh... <laughs> I love when I this giant, Come on. like... Let's go look Angry around. guy <laughs> is is like has to be gentle. Yeah, I think they're sold under a different name Don't outside the states, up. Coleridge. Maybe you should join your friend upstairs. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Maybe you should join your friend Wait, upstairs. She definitely should be woken. Apparently, no one was looking. Someone took the bag, stuffed it in their backpack, put it in their locker until the end of school, then. Marlene. Back in their bag and took it home on the bus. Oh man. I'll let you figure out who. <laughs> Some enterprising young lad. I um I did that. Um I would I wouldn't like necessarily take whole bags, but I would definitely like I'm sorry. stow things from No. The I'm face the one who asked such. her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. Because she's an ancient, is that it? So she told you about that. She must well, trust you all a great deal. Not as not as such. Uh, don't worry about it. Yes. Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. Some of the chips did get crushed up. She's not well, some casualties. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. I don't think that kid did anything About wrong. Fifteen years ago. In my humble opinion. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. How long ago was it? But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But he didn't come. Hmm. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day Here I go. to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. 
I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. No, that's true, it was. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I mean... What can you say to that? The kid was like, oh my god. Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. Oh, jeez. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. In action? Were they fighting? Maybe they're basically the police force? Things like that. She'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came Oh, Wu Tai, that's right. We we know about Coming. that. <laughs> he looks the same. No! Go away! <sighs> hmm. You notice that? Aaron, yes, he does. You know, you're same. not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, Who are the ancients? They were the original also, stories yeah, of the you're planet, right, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the promised land. <clears throat> Some believe the promised land to be a myth, others, an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! But Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew it's a really it good wasn't liar. true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home. Once they get what they need. I doubt it. Wow, Claude. You're not planning anything, way, are way you? Way to put some hope in this mother's Don't make things worse than they life. already are. If I lost her, too, I don't know if I could... If I could ever... Just don't. It's okay, we, we replaced her with another little girl you raised. Right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe 
We'd be better off waiting a little while. I think that little girl is spoken for, actually. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Uh. Okay. Yeah, let's go to the smoldering heap of wreckage where the bar is supposed to be and tell ourselves we're going to fix it. I think you might have things stashed in the basement or something. Actually, yeah, we, I guess we might get to see the basement. Take care of yourselves now. Take care of yourselves now. Oh, go see Marlene. I was going to say, like, she's not even going to mention, like, I'll take care of Marlene. She's just a very direct person. That's not where Marlene is. It is pretty up here, though. Yeah. You're like, oh, where are you going? Tifa, maybe it'd be better if we did some side quests. <laughs> oh! This is her room, isn't it? Yeah. You can sleep in her bed. Go in this fight. I promise. Oh, no, wait, that's, that's that where Marlene is. Yeah. Oh, she's so tiny. Oh, Marlene is staying in Aerith's room. Yeah, so this is it. Win this bite. I promise. It's a bite bite. Can you look at Aerith's personal documents? Boo. She likes flowers. She was like, What's the mythical amulet? Why, why are you sniffing her pillow? But mom let me sleep in her room. <laughs> Just pushing all these poor people out of the way. Go away. Go away there. Alright, will not be manhandled as easily. You found a cool accessory called the mythical amulet. We can steal Aerith's precious mythical amulet by reading her documents off limits. An amulet that exalts the flare entities said to keep watch over the planet, strengthens some called for. Cool. Nobody has a slot left for that, right? What do you mean? For the mythical amulet? Uh, it's an accessory. So. I mean, technically no, but, like, you should be switching those out when you find a better one. We'll keep the light machine- <coughs> Sorry! Bless you. Light machine gun, right? Probably. And then... Hmm. Would you mind working on this? Um... I need to drink something or get a cough drop. I'm not feeling so good. Oh, sorry, I was supposed to make you some tea. I started eating it up. Do you want me to do it? Um. Or do you want to do it? No, it's okay. It's, it's in the kettle. Yeah. Okay, that's probably done. I will just grab the um, grab the water and bring it over. Okay, I'll do some finagling. All right. Yep. All right. We'll probably just give him a two. How does he have star star pendant immune to poison? Probably not. Um, immune to sleep, maybe. Yeah, let's just do immune to sleep. Why not? Okay. Make sure to spend our weapon points first, in case we get extra materia slots. That looks like an extra materia slot. Yep. Okay. Hey! Let's 
Let's just do attack power. And We want to buy for him. I mean, another attack power. Might as well. And for the T5. Cool, let's get her better speed stat. Speed plus seven seems pretty significant. Because her speed is forty yeah, forty seven. Yeah, that's a pretty big upgrade. Nearly a twenty five percent more speed. Okay. Well, we're gonna need a new magic person. Why not Barrett? Give Barrett lightning on his. Oh, actually, why don't we do the? Um, I like the wind uh, magnify. I think that's pretty cool. Ice. Give him the lightning. And what else did Aerith have on MP up and magic up? Yeah, that makes sense. We do the fat chocobo. Yeah, let's do the fat chocobo. I know. And the salvation bed. That seems good. The main entrance to Sector 7 is buried under rubble now. So how are we supposed to get back inside? Underground passage in the park. Ah, uh, good plan. But how do we get to the park? I know another way to get there. Aerith showed me before. <laughs> this ancient girl knows her stuff. Didn't mean anything by it. There was this and <laughs> he like corrected himself before anybody chastised him about it. Find Chadley. Turn in our quest. Yep, there he is. Hey, bud. Cloud, I'm glad to see that you're okay. In these trying times, I hope to develop new materia to help us endure. Buddy, hey, love. I've come up with a fascinating to do. theory. Otherwise, said buddy. You can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I just put all of Aerith's stuff on Barrett, so Barrett is now our magic guy. It. Nice. That's really interior. funny to me. <laughs> We've got enemy skill materia. Gives you a chance to learn enemy techniques that you've endured and use them as abilities. These abilities can only be used when the materia is set to your equipment. 
Uh, you got an ATB stagger materia. Increases ATB when staggering an enemy. I We're all good on VR missions. All of your future battle intel submissions. You got some new battle intel missions. Um, you need to increase the stagger damage bonus to 200%. Or parry materia um, which is kind of a misnomer because um, it's just a, it's like a dodge attack oh, gosh, yeah. Yeah. Um, trigger the refocus limit break two times for ATB assist materia and defeat monsters of 10 unique varieties or HP absorption materia We're going to try to get back into Sector 7 through the underground passage that Aerith showed us. Um, Makes sense. Because the main path is blocked. Mm. My ears are still ringing from it. You can take over at any time, by the way. Thank you. Yeah. I'm regaining my strength. Good. Over there. Sometimes I try to run this way. Where's this going in? Oh, it just goes to Walmart, yeah. I'm not sure. I think these guys were here before. I would believe you. Moogle metal get. Why don't I automatically feel better? <laughs> automatically and instantly. Why not? <laughs> yeah, these poor Shinra guys. There, that way. We'll have to fight our way through. But it's our only shot. These poor Shinra guys are like, oh man, somebody slashed all of these boxes too. Well, get a new shipment of boxes in here. Uh, Sarge, I think most of these boxes are empty. Yep, just bring them in. <laughs> We're hoping if he hits enough empty ones, he'll stop. Oh yeah? Oh yeah? Do you want me to keep playing? Okay. Nothing to it. 
Oh, I see. You're gonna lay down over there. That's fair. I thought you meant you were gonna, like, go lay down. No. Oh, I see. There's just two ways forward. We're ready for any. What? <laughs> Monsters originally created by Shinra's R&D division, but are now feral after some escaped the lab and bred in the wild. I don't know why they were not expecting that. Tactical data not available. Enemy skills can be learned from this monster. Oh, but he hasn't read the, the name. Oh. Vargpolis. Thank you. Yeah. And then you drop sedative. <laughs> they know Thundara, Spinning Blow, and Self Destruct. Okay. Bring it home! Noise. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Yeah. Let's keep him straight for a second. Go get some of Where? Oh, you made two more? Well, I only made. I only. I only grabbed one of them. I see, I see, okay. Just put a control, yeah. Just... yeah? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Alright, well I guess it reaches, so no problem with that. I won't lose! <laughs>
villain are you, actually? Let's switch it up. Gloves up. Uh, just fully on the floor, huh? Oh yeah. Yep. Cool. Well, happy see. birthday. <laughs> Thank you, John. Thank you for being who you are. Excellent. Thanks for making it to 25. That's right. How's your day going? Just, just fine. Mr. Mayo. <laughs> Oh, this is Cloud. Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, check that out. Right? Yes. Like, Cloud from Smash Bros. This is the game he's <laughs> So they can keep the status quo. Uh, no, we didn't go here before. The way that we went with Aerith was blocked off. Oh, okay. You seem to be doing fine. If you want to, if you want to just play like that, that's fine. Okay. I have a man. Oh, oh look at me. Oh, you want to look at some cool stuff? Look at that. That is really cool. For the record, I haven't really noticed the stereotype of like men having more trouble with gold spread candles than very well. I didn't know about that stereotype until you said it just now, so you're actually perpetuating it. Yeah, I was the one that... <laughs> Look at these! Look at these creeps! Look at them creeping! Maybe creeping. Ooh! Ooh, he's creeping! Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> just, just me and my bro creeping around a, a three-foot square space. <laughs> looking, looking for punks. Cyberpunk mod mm -hmm. looks good. Yep. Yeah, this mod. <laughs> no, see, um, if it was cyberpunk, these guys would be saying all sorts of vulgar shit, like whatever Vex had on his um, uh, his sound redeems for a while. It, oh yeah, it was like <laughs> it was. Come on, put it, show yourself. Oh my god, are you serious? Yeah. Don't hold that. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Let me try that again. There we go. Chop him in half. Another one in the bag. Oh my. No problem. Oh. What's he doing? He's just like crouching. He set a trap. Don't overdo it. Yeah. I don't think I'm falling for that. A significantly buggy game, there'd be controversy. Needing free therapy. Everybody needs free therapy. But cyberpunk devs, especially. Children a movie? I don't know what Advent Children was, I just know it had Final Fantasy 7 characters in it. Okay, yeah, it was a movie. With his massive bulk, he delivers devastating blows one after the other. He likes his fights clean and fair, and remains honorable in victory and defeat. 
Dealing damage interrupts his attacks, but he soon counters with a throwing technique. Evading the attack and hitting him while his guard is down makes him susceptible to stag staggering. You can steal a champion belt from him! That's his Oh my god. <laughs> That. Oh man. Yep, some Tomodachi time I heard. Let's finish this. Does stealing work better when you stagger? No, come on! Come on, I can't steal the champion's belt from him! You would think that it would be, like, 100% chance of it. Stole a champion's belt, I did it! Oops. Took you long enough. There's a sequel movie following up after the original. It's only known for the big fight at the end of Sephiroth and some badass remixes of Final Fantasy songs. That's well, nice. and it's known for Cloud gets a new outfit. Is it a that's that's, that's how I know it from. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Time heals all wounds. I haven't aged a day in years. Oh, Life can still get you works. down even after you've grown up. Wow. I, man, I love the idea that somebody's just coming down here and spray painting this on the wall thinking they're like real, like, uh... We got it all wrong. This is their vision deep. board, and they're like, like, using it to pump themselves up before they go to work at time. <laughs> that too. Okay. We, we can agree, though. Oh, are you okay, buddy? An orb of gravity. Alright, w when do you think we should do the Tomodachi time? When are we ready, Nibby? Okay. Maybe once we get out of the stun room. Finally! Go there! I skipped that. <laughs> 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 you do. This is where I would like to steal this from him. He got off this and went and placed somewhere else. And I was like, alright, yes, it's done. <laughs> you can steal it from him, it's yours. What's wrong? It's too far away from the Atechi, though. It's on now. That's that. It's over. He's like, uh, this is a dog. Yep, this is what you get. You Oh. You hear that? Come on. Tifa said, um, I'm almost afraid to go uh I'm almost afraid to go back to see it with my own eyes. Yeah. It's not a <laughs> Music does not seem to think so. And that chocolate. Does it look like we can go this way? No. Like There's monsters the everywhere. Best thing I've ever eaten in my life. <laughs> Never would have crossed our minds back then. And that chocolate donut. But could drop out of the sky. But the... Pretty sure this ought to take us straight to the Sector Five slums. I could die happy, but I won't. I'm, I'm gonna stay alive and die bitter. <laughs> Wow! 
Grimer! <sighs> You're alive! Who's this? Still in one piece. Who else made it out? Named NPC. <laughs> I wish I knew. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. I'm just glad you survived. Gives me hope for the other. There's plans for a higher mm. stakes stream than, than uh, that actually. Yeah, actually. So I, I, I love making cake on stream. Bad. Don't get me wrong. <sighs> Let me, uh, I should have updated that. I totally forgot we agreed upon that. Yeah, I, I, uh, I, I told Red that we could do something. But only if you pay me a ridiculous amount of money. Yep. So we're gonna, we're gonna raise some funds to pay Sriracha a ridiculous amount of money to do something. Okay. Actually, can I scooter? Can you see? There we go. We can see the birthday girl. All right. Let's get this going. Put the put the can info into night. Can I pick the color though? Because if I do it that color, I'll have to bleach my hair, and I don't really want to bleach it. So could I just do it uh, red? What? Um, instead of doing it, I do it red. I don't want to bleach my hair. Will it not work if you try to dye it pink? Um, it will make it pinkish, but I don't know exactly how it'll work with the tones that are already in there. I mean, your hair is super, well, pretty light. Hmm. I think the deal was for pink. Well. Hmm. I wouldn't want to try to bleach my hair. Because. If, what, so. what if it was a chow collab? Hmm. More, more money required. How much? Two hundred? Yeah, I think so because I didn't. Yeah, I didn't account for the the cost of bleaching my hair and the emotional cost. Okay. Because I'm very scared it's gonna like dry out my hair and ruin it forever. <laughs> red go blue that that's not on the table right now all right here we go let's see we're out of two hundred dollars raised actually hold on we've got we we had some today hold on i gotta edit that because we already had today 611 bits There we go. Nice. Congrats, Wolf. Okay, let's get Tomodachi time going. There it goes. Thank you. 
Uh, it's pretty tough. Life. Featuring the wolf staff. Slowkey, me, and Sammy, and Elizabeth. Congratulations. Thanks for watching. For your four o'clock me news, this is Indie Bomb, signing off. Thank you, Snortier. I appreciate it. Sammy first in line for donations. Uh. Ooh, we got the unknown hero mask. It's Crazy Mask Man. What, never heard of him? Neither have we. Uh, come back soon. Well, we got a dressy cardigan. Pair a formal skirt with this cardigan for a touch of sophistication. I think, I think that sort of addition to the, the cake and the Oh yeah? No, you shouldn't, because then nobody else gets to enjoy it. Fair. You got the sweet dress. This frilly dress is so oh. cute, it makes bunnies feel bad about themselves. Wow. The Versailles court dress, and a couple more colors. Have a nice day. Is this unknown hero as good as Invincible Crab Man? We'll have to wait for the crossover to find out. Oh yeah, indestructible. Be harmed, just never destroyed. Johnny Mayo has uh, has some questions. He's ready I've got to ask. A lot on my mind. Oh my gosh! Big moment here. I have feelings for Elizabeth. I've got to tell her. Uh, yeah, do it. How should I tell her? Um. What is that hair? Be uh. Be romantic. She's a she's a real ro tell her? A romantic. She's the definition of a romantic. Uh probably not on a tower. Yeah, that might traumatize Yeah, no, not there. Uh how about at the at the beach? She did seem to like the beach. She does like the beach. Should I get changed first? Uh hold on. Yeah, we probably you probably shouldn't be wearing the long day outfit. Oh yeah, go in your go in your nice Probably not suit to the I beach. Just, I can't Maybe like a nice cardigan to the beach. Ooh, shirt and khakis? Oh yeah, John yeah. looks good in shirt and khakis. John looks good in shirt and khakis. And a regal crown just to just to, to that, spice it up a little bit. Sends the right message. Yeah. Yeah, like I'm approachable, but I'm also extra. Okay, I'm ready. Time to gather my courage and tell her how I feel. Still haven't gotten either the all time or super all time. Yeah, nope. Okay, she did show up. Here we go. Moment of truth. My love for you is deeper than the ocean. 
Will you be my beautiful mermaid? Wow. How do you say no to that? Don't. You don't. You just don't. Uh-oh. Bylan! Bylan, you're Bylan, married. married. By Bylan is married. Bylan is married to I Rose. Right? <laughs> Bylan is married? I believe? Wait. Oh, no. <laughs> Alright, I just finished a water level. <laughs> I love you the most. Oh my I gosh. I think John has this one in the back. No way. John <laughs> used the best pickup line. Elizabeth, who do you choose? Oh, that's my that's my pizza. He's still gripping. She's gonna pick Mario. Mario, I'm so glad you feel the same. Everyone always freaking goes for Mario. How do you, how do you, like, if a guy climbs out of the ocean for you, like, how do you say no to that? In a hamster suit. So, what do you think about us becoming sweethearts? Yeah, yeah it's great. Yeah, that's great. So, is Violet wow. divorced? Yeah, go take a look at Wow. By land or by sea. <laughs> wow. Ooh. I was rejected. Ouch. It's not Mario, it's Chris Pratt. <laughs> the real Chris Pratt. Uh, there he is. There's Bylan. Bylan, get in here. Look at them, the two of them are so sad. Wait, who else is sad? Is that Rose? Excellent. Ex spouses. Why did Violet and Rose break up? I lose all sense of time when I'm surfing the net on my laptop. I don't know. So Violet's not seeing anyone right now, maybe? No, he's not. Seems so mean you can tell John it would be a great idea to go for it, then at the heartbreak event to be like, Yeah, Mario and Elizabeth, this is a great idea. Yeah, that's rough. Wait, Ryan, why is Ryden sad? He's probably divorced, too. Why is everyone getting divorced? I they were married like to Oh! Wow. Ex-sweetheart Elizabeth! She just, she only wants to date other video game characters. That's she... why John couldn't get in there. Oh, she left Ryden for Mario. Yeah. Yeah, she did. Oh no. She's like, I need, to, I need some Nintendo product. This guy can get me a Switch. Oh man, okay. Uh, well, I have to go get my pizza, so I'm gonna leave you guys watching the, um, uh, the piggy o the Piggy OP Man. I think that's what your name is. Thank you. I Hope think you're enjoying. Piggy OP like overpower? Yeah, the, well, yeah. yeah. That's what I guessed too. Yeah, you're correct. Um, you're what's happening there? What's what's happening there? Do, do you see this? <laughs> Somebody's spying on Zagreus? Sriracha, you, you gotta keep your deep love for Zagreus under wraps. You can't let everybody know. It looks like Zagreus is coughing to someone, but I guess he's just really, really into whatever he's eating. He's moving his mouth so much. <laughs> is, it, is that you? No, I think that's Sammy. I think that okay. might be Sammy. Well, I mean, everybody is in love with Zagreus. Yeah. How do you not want that? Okay. Ooh, Sortier got us a mystery bag. Alright, what'd you fill the mystery bag with, Sortier? A maid outfit! Beautiful. A corn dog. Okay. And a straw hat. Two new pieces of clothing. Oops. 
I bumped it. Sorry. Uh, I just, uh, I just crashed the, the 3DS viewer. Okay, forgive you. But it's okay, because... Wait, when did I swear? Did I swear? I don't think I swore. Oh, no, I, I think I said I, I bumped it, didn't I? Uh, end task. Why is end task not working on this, uh, this instance of the thing? Uh... It's it's unkillable. Task manager can't kill it. What? Uh oh. And and if I open a new one, a second version of it comes up that I can kill, but it doesn't bring up a window that I can... What? No! I don't want to restart my computer. Come on! I'm in the middle of something. Oh my god. I've never seen this. I've never seen end task not work on on task manager. I think I just have to restart the stream. I have to restart my computer. And there's Windows updates too. Because of course there are. Uh... a new task manager try that nope it's unkillable it crashed so hard I can't kill the process <sighs> okay well uh, I'll be back I guess maybe I'll just you know I'll restart without I'm just gonna like end task the um the OBS so that uh maybe it'll just be the the not like this screen <laughs> and I can keep my solid VOD. Let's find out. See you in a bit. <laughs>